Hi Aries, welcome in. You're watching the Sacred Sun Tarot and this is going to be a reading for the week, right? Aries, Moon Rising, Venus, Jupiter and Sun. Let's see what messages we have. And reverse the roles if needed, switch the cases and sometimes these, these messages resonate in paths. So take what resonates, leave the rest. Do not stress about it, okay? Aries. If you feel like connecting with me, the link for the Instagram is in the description box. Okay. We have the world in reverse. What is not ending, Aries? What is not coming to an end? We have the magician here. Okay. So you are trying on something. You are trying to build something or you're trying to work over something. And the cycle is still not over yet right it's still not over some things have to be processed some things have to be worked upon let us see where it heads right the world Aries let's use reversals also today let's see what messages we have okay seven of pentacles I think something is not over and you're still waiting on to the result, right? Can be any investment, maybe any situation you were investing in. You're still waiting on to the results here. We have five of cups. Maybe there was a phase when you were overthinking about it. You were having some negative thoughts about it. But now the situation is changing. Some ray of hope is still there. And that's why that phase of negativity is over now. You're waiting on to something here. You thought it was over, but probably it was not. Okay, we have Ace of Cups reversed and Nine of Wands in reversed. There was a, a hope of emotional new beginning in some situation. You were holding on to it and maybe that's why you were just think, having negative thoughts and you were not letting the other positive stuff come your way. But I think now you're, you're, now you're done overthinking. You're not thinking about what happened in past. You're not thinking about uh, that could have been this, that could have been that, that could have been the emotional thing. All those thoughts are no more there. It's like nine of wands energy in reversed. No more holding on to past and totally open to some new beautiful things coming your way, right? No more thinking about what it could have been. We have nine of cups and that's very beautiful you know feeling fulfilled where you are right now where you don't have any stress of past and uh, probably you are a bit hopeful about the future but at the same time you're not overthinking about it so i see a beautiful face where you are more or less feeling content in some situation though there is some patience needed though there is some weight is still there but i think you are somehow content or you will be feeling content in something because some information might come your way and you'll feel yeah i don't need to overthink in this situation we have the strength here strong support from the universe strong guidance from the universe and can you see the infinity sign here immense power is coming towards you from the universe and you will be able to deal with this situation what next okay we have the star in reverse and the two of wands, wands in reverse okay for some of you this was more like i'm strongly picking up that you were hoping for something continuously hoping for something in past uh, maybe a decision which was not made a, a pending decision i'm picking up for some of you and they probably did not decide right or something like that but i think you're giving up on it and not in a bad way, not in a feeling that uh, I'm disappointed, I'm never going to have it. No, it's more like I don't need it anymore, right? I think I'm content here and I'm just wasting my time over something. It's not needed. Very, very positive shift in attitude though. Let us see what messages we have. We also have the three of pentacles here and two of swords reversed popping out of the deck. So... I pick up more like maybe you were waiting on to some switch, some change, some decision where something related to your current situation could have changed, right? Maybe a new job, new relationship, marriage, something could have changed here. But uh, now you are coming to this realization that 
probably the current situation is more fulfilling and i don't know i have not seen the unseen right now so don't know what what can happen what can result what it can result into so i see that positive change here i should be working more at the present situation on the present situation i should be investing more in the present situation i have some good opportunities which i might not be looking at right now or maybe you are just not able to focus on them right now because in past there were some other involvements right what else we have the queen of wands here you are here you are with a very positive shift in your energies uh, aries queen of wands energy this is you back in your power back in your energy looking for uh, new options new opportunities not waiting on to those things which were not fulfilling feeling very attractive feeling very energetic and go get a kind of energy right nine of cups with the queen of wands i'm content where i am and what i'm going to do from now is going to be more fulfilling no turning backwards no going backwards that kind of energy very positive what else okay messages for aries okay okay something okay we have six of wands here beautiful energy moving towards your success and i see a lot of attention also coming your way aries because maybe you were trying to run behind some things in past and they were just running away from you i see some kind of reverse psychology here this can be a relationship this can be a connection and pending you were waiting on to and now when you are giving up on the weight you're giving up on the thinking you're giving up on that on that thought to be with somebody all the time to have something all the time now things are changing for most of you it's like the moment you release that stubborn thought of holding on to something you're getting a lot of attention and you're coming back to power for some of you this also can be that let me play the field let me see what else is out there for me okay beautiful messages for Aries let's see what's cooking up we have two of cups in reverse yes not investing in some connection anymore Aries not investing in a connection anymore maybe this can be unrequited love this can be uh, having proposals but turning them down having some love offer and turning it down not feeling uh, loved anymore and feeling like walking away from something what else we have seven of wands reversed not fighting for something anymore five of wands you know there's a lot of conflict in some situation and you don't want to fight for it anymore okay let's clarify let's clarify a few cards aries moon rising venus jupiter and sun what were you holding on to what were you patiently waiting on to okay Okay, a lot of cards are here we have temperance okay we have five of pentacles we also have the devil here and a lot of cards temperance sad energy devil capricorn energy it took some time to recover from something maybe that was the phase of patience maybe that cycle was not ending and uh, it took some time to sit and think about something i see a phase where you were quietly thinking about something right and now when you're letting it go temperance energy again letting go energy five of cups reversed not thinking about it anymore nine of wands reversed not holding on to it anymore what was this temperance energy i want to know ace of cups in reversed okay unrequited love the offer that was not made you were hoping for something it, it did not show up other way around you were trying to offer some love to somebody that person did not respond but this is not uh, the energy of feeling sad or feeling bad about it right rejection is god's protection if you rejected somebody maybe it was a protection for them and if someone rejected you it was a project it was a protection for you right so I don't really feel that you're getting bothered about it anymore somewhere at heart you do feel that some cycle has not yet ended you have something with this person and the cycle might come back to you in future because 
this connection is not over yet right but maybe the feeling of investing into this thing or the situation is dying out somewhere i see unrequited love here okay what is this nine of cups i want to know something that is making you feel very satisfied emotionally fulfilled wish come true kind of energy knight of oh my god knight of wands queen of cups in the world again okay so this is the point where the cycle ends right in the recent past maybe you felt that the cycle is not getting over and i'm still investing there where i shouldn't be investing that kind of energy knight of wands ready to play the field ready to see what's there out for me again the queen of wands energy and the moment you do that i definitely see some better opportunities coming your way someone is making or preparing the cup again for somebody else so for some of you who have been through some kind of breakup recently or some emotional connection that did not work out i see that you are getting into your power again and ready to play the field again right beautiful change in energy for rest of you this can be that in, there's an understanding that i have to bring some changes i have to end some cycle to move in a particular direction that understanding is actually giving you a lot of power wow seven of cups energy picking up better options looking for better options that's quite good what is uh, the two of cups in reverse what is the two of cups in reverse for aries we have the seven of cups in reverse okay king of swords under the deck I mean, I libra aquarius energy with the king of swords giving up on confusion right seven of cups with the two of cups that's quite positive actually what is this seven of cups energy in reverse we have Page of Swords, even being more skeptical, you know, you might be getting more information, you might be getting more uh, clarity. Page of Swords always looks for more knowledge, clarity and information before they take any stand or make any move. Totally being skeptical about whatever conversation comes your way, checking for the background, not trusting anything blindly. Let me see what, are, what is this Page of Swords? What are you skeptical about? Three of Pentacles and Ten of Swords. Okay, working again on something, working over something which probably died, which probably didn't go well, and probably had a very tiring and uh, not very satisfying ending, right? So now working again over it might not be your cup of tea. And I see a strong passion in your energy where I need to see other things as well. I need to see what else is there for me out there. I shouldn't be sitting and regretting about anything that's a very positive shift in your energies what is this seven of wands in reverse we have uh, the page of pentacles okay some conversation is coming in which you're definitely blocking or it's simply that i don't want to talk right i don't want to show interest here what is this page of pentacles two of swords and the death yes you are ready for this transformation hierophant can be taurus energy can be Aries Leo said Gemini Libra Aquarius I'm sorry Gemini Libra Aquarius energy here page of pentacles two of swords and the death right there's some communication coming your way Aries regarding the situation maybe this person wants to work with you again or whatever this offer proposal is they want to work with you again but two of swords energy I think you will take some time out think about it not addressing the issue you know the conversation is about to be there and you're not in a mood to address it towards the end i see that there is a fluctuation in your expectations regarding this proposal and then you might take some time to process it and finally we have death the closure you needed the transformation you needed is actually happening here but i think it's good for you and you are teaching a lesson here to other people with the hierophant Telling other people what decision you made was actually something that was needed. Let's have some messages and then we will wind up the reading. Rest and rejuvenate. Five. Okay, four of swords and four of pentacles. Discontent and boredom. I see the situation was turning very boring and discontent, right? Uh, I see dis dissatisfaction here because of uh, maybe a conflict, maybe opinion conflict, maybe lack of honest conversation. You tried holding on to it for a moment, but now you're like, 
I shouldn't be doing that anymore. It's not justified for me. So I see some phase where you might take a break from, from all the dissatisfying energies in your surroundings and uh, then finally coming back from it and telling people exactly what you want. That's actually a positive shift and giving closure to everybody who needs. Not just for them, but for your satisfaction also. So these are the messages for you, Aries, for this time period. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Bye-bye.